Hello everyone and welcome back to another exciting episode of the Wild Wonders of Southern Africa. Today I'm here in KwaZulu-Natal on the East Coast where uh, I'm leading a tour and basically I'm going to show my tourists some of the fascinating wildlife and plant life that uh, KwaZulu-Natal has to offer. And in KwaZulu-Natal you also get a palm that is called the raffia palm and it is the largest palm tree in the world. Now palms have massive leaves and this particular palm tree that I'm going to show you today actually has the largest palm leaves in the world making it the largest leaf in the world as well. So hang on for a moment and I'm going to show you that. Right now the raffia palm also has some cultural and traditional uses. Um, here in South Africa they've used it to make rope and weave baskets and all sorts of things. So you can see here there's a couple of um, raffia palm leaves that have fallen down and they've used the underside there as, let me just show you, that side there to weave baskets and especially the Zulu tribe of KwaZulu-Natal have been using it for many many years. Now, other areas in Africa they've also used it to make raffia palm wine and apparently it's quite good. Uh, the raffia palm tree occurs throughout uh, Africa and also Madagascar, especially Madagascar. And what is amazing is you get some different uh, varieties of these palm trees. Now, what's fantastic, here in KwaZulu-Natal, in uh, an area called Mtanzini, there's this one specific raffia palm that actually has a natural monument named after it and also established just specifically for it and it's here in this small little town of Mtanzini where you get these beautiful raffia palm trees let me just show you there in the back there oh loads of them and some of these trees can actually get up to 25 meters tall so it's quite fantastic so I'm going to try and get to one of the areas where it's a little bit of a clearing and you will be able to see just how fantastic these trees are but uh, loads of cultural uses but also some natural uses. There's a vulture called the palm nut vulture that loves these seeds. So let me go and show you. Right guys, so that there is one of the tallest raffia palms here in Mtanzini. And I'm gonna just go down a bit so you can see how magnificent these palm trees are. So just for reference, you can see how tiny the people look against these beautiful raffia palms. So this is a bit of a clearing where some of the palm trees have fallen over, but they are just fantastic. I'll scan around here. There's a couple of vervet monkeys here as well. Um, a lot of animals love the seeds and the fruit of the raffia palm. And let's see if I can show you that little vervet monkey there. There he is. It's a dominant male. Anyway, so these are the raffia palm trees. And that's it from my side. Right guys, I hope you enjoyed this episode of the Wild Wonders of Southern Africa. As always, please remember to subscribe, share and like the video. And uh, I will post a couple of videos here for you guys if you're interested. Remember to have a look at some of my playlists. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.